Hi Alma, I'm Lauren, I am 26 and I am from Manchester which is where I'm currently living until I make the move down to London in two weeks which is very very exciting. Um, I have just finished my five week intense train, personal training course with the training room and I loved every single minute of it. Um, I've wanted to do it now for about a year so I got back from New Zealand last summer which is where I lived for two and a half years um, and that's really where my fitness journey began I would say. I travelled there solo um, just to really explore, meet new people, see a different culture um, and I ended up staying there for two and a half years um, and it definitely changed my life I would say. So I got really got into fitness um, just by like hiking and the walks there were just so beautiful and it just made me want to sack off the going out every single weekend which don't get me wrong still love to do it but I just saw a different side to life that I hadn't yet experienced um, and that was just seeing like the beauty and nature so I really got into my, my hiking I really got into running and then I started visiting um, all the gyms where I was traveling around and the problem I had at home before going to the gym is I just didn't feel that confident in trying new things so I would just go and stick to what I knew whereas over there because I didn't know anyone um, and the gyms were only tiny they had about five pieces of equipment um, in these little towns and I would just go on my own and just taught myself how to use like all the resistance machines probably not properly but I gave it my best go um, and I just really loved it and I started to see bit of change in my body but mainly a change in my mental health um, and just the benefits I thought were amazing so I thought you know what I'd actually quite like other people to experience this people that thought they weren't really into fitness and um, and just to know how how good it is not just for your body but in my opinion for your mind um, so that was last year. I got home and I booked onto the training room course once I was home. Um, but in between then and me doing the course, which I've just finished, um, I have been a manager at a cafe. Uh, and it's a wellbeing cafe in Manchester. And it's not just like your regular in, out, turnover, coffees, although we do all of that, obviously. But it's more about building a really good experience for the customers. And we get quite a lot of vulnerable people coming in and um, people that are quite poorly and they come and they just really want to chat with me and the other girls because it's an all girls team at the moment well it has been for six months now and i've absolutely loved it um, and i've made friends for life both with the the team and some customers and it's just taught me a lot about people being vulnerable and just needing help from someone they don't know but they put a lot of trust in you um, so yeah, I've loved it and I'm going to miss it, but I am very ready for my new adventure. So that kind of brings me on to why I want to train women in particular. Um, to be perfectly honest, I think I am most confident around women um, and I'm obviously a woman myself. So I think it's easier to relate and I just want women to feel confident in their own skin because we have a lot of pressure in this day and age of how you should look and it's really just about how you feel i don't think it matters how you look as long as you feel good and you are happy then that is all we need so i think more women need to feel this way rather than comparing themselves and if i can help just one person feel that way then i'll be pretty happy so um lastly because i'm seeing my time ticking up here um Lastly, holistic health to me is more of a take it as an individual approach. So everyone is so, so different and everyone has such different needs from in their daily lives. So we can't treat people like they're in a box. And sometimes that happens, I think. Um, and it's like you've got to meet certain, tick certain boxes. Whereas I think if we look at people as the individuals they are and how they live their lives, then it's easy to create positive change in that way and um, so yeah i hope to hear back from you soon and hope you have a great weekend